Good Monday morning, everyone. WTF Sexy Headphones here. Happy Monday mornings to you guys. <laughs> uh, another one where I'm just going to be out of it and tired. Anyway, in, 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 inside, okay, I was about to say inside out. I'm like, what's that? Isn't that a movie? Inside, yes. So a lot of you guys recommended inside for a short new Let's Play uh, which is made by the makers of Limbo, so another puzzly styled game, kind of similar scrolling format from what I've seen, um, just with a little bit more color. I, I've never actually heard of that until my comments were all just like, have you seen this yet? Have you seen this? Hey, what about this? And I'm like, oh, okay. Um, and I know a lot of you, of course, are also recommending Stalker and be like, we need to do more Stalker. I just think it'll be nice to take a little bit of a break and do something different, a little bit more refreshing, just to kind of get things changed up, because I do love Stalker, um, but it's a very intense game, so it's kind of nice to take a lazy break from it. So I'm thinking that we're probably gonna do inside then. I'm thinking I'm gonna have to go buy that in like two seconds here, and go snag that, because, you know, I like, I like the little puzzle games. Granted, as you guys know with me, I'm not always the best at figuring things out, but I like to think that's part of the fun. Though, I think for some people it's not as fun when they know what's going on and they know the puzzles and they're all like, why can't you figure it out? I've figured it out. But it's all like, bitch, how long did it take you to fucking figure it out? Or are you just like, oh, I just magically knew everything and what to do? No, I don't fucking think so. You did not magically know what to fucking do. You had a struggle like the rest of us. You just get to see my struggle, okay? Anyway. So I'm thinking that we're going to give that a try because it looks pretty neat. I like the idea of it and I don't foresee it being a long game just like Limbo was. Limbo was what, like six, six play, six episodes, something, seven, I don't know. I can't even remember anymore because it was really fucking short. It took me only like, it's like this big. So I'm assuming that inside is going to be very much the same, that it's not going to be a very long game. And again, from what I've been told, 35 millimeters is not a very long game. So I figured we can probably take a break from Half-Life. Yes, you guys, I will continue Half-Life. There's a lot of you bitching like, oh my God, so help me if you don't finish fucking episode two. I will finish it, guys. It's called a break. We need a break. It's your fault. We need a break. We'll come back together probably but for now we're, we're on a break. <laughs> um, sorry, I got off on a tangent there. Yeah, so that's probably what we're going to do then is we're gonna do inside because I, I, I just, I wanna try something different. I wanna do something a little bit tiny, a little bit newer, and then we'll go from there and then we'll probably jump right back into our usual stalker Half-Life until Half-Life's done and then it's like, well, we got nothing to do until Black Mesa finishes and then I can literally finish the end of Black Mesa but until that happens, you know, once we're done with Half-Life, then you guys are going to have to fucking think of something else because Half-Life will be over unless you fucking whip Valve's ass into shape. But we all know Valve does not know how to count to three, so it's probably pretty impossible for that to happen, but you never know. So that's pretty much all I wanted to talk about this <sighs> Monday morning. Yes. Yeah. Everything will be continued, we'll go back to Stalker, we'll go back to Half-Life, but we're gonna try this inside that like a fuck ton of you guys were throwing at, uh, throwing in my comments. We're gonna, we're gonna give that a go, we're gonna, we're gonna try that. We're gonna try that, guys. Um, I think that's it, okay, anyway. So random fact story time. So I got a, like a, like a lip thing, lip, what is it? It's like a lip, gloss but not like a what are they called? liquid like a liquid lip stick <laughs> as you guys could tell I'm super knowledgeable when it comes to lady stuff but anyway so I got a whatever the fuck it is I just said <laughs> I got that from um, Sephora or whatever because I saw someone else wearing it I'm like oh that looks super pretty like I want to try that of which I still have not because I don't really pizzazz myself up really much besides just like oh here's some foundation on my face uh, now my skin tone doesn't look messy but other than that so they gave you the option to choose like oh like choose five samples so I'm like oh that's cool like I get to choose like samples are the best I love samples so I get my like my, my lip whatever in and I get like my five samples and it lists like all the things that I picked because you get to like out of their list you get to pick them and then I don't think they gave me a single one 
that I asked for, but the one that I am most confused about, and maybe someone can help me with this because I still have been too lazy to research it, I have something that they gave me called Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. Now, when I think of Brazilians, you think of the butts. Brazilians like the butts. So, like, would this, would this be legitly for butts, guys? Because, I mean, I don't, I mean, I don't really research butt creams. I'm, I'm guessing they exist. Maybe, maybe, like, maybe exist. It's like a Brazilian bumbum cream, guys. I don't know. I don't know what this is or if it's just a weird name because you know how like makeups can have really weird names and and strange shit and stuff like you know they could like they think of weird crap you know so I'm like it could be just like a facial cream or body cream or something like that but I don't know they're playing to Brazil's butts and they're just like Brazilian bum bum cream or maybe it is butt cream I don't fucking know what do I use this for guys I got this sample I have not looked it up yet I'll probably in the process of rendering this afterwards still forget to look it up but I'm mean, yeah I got I got all these samples and I'm confused about because this was I remember seeing this one too in their list of sample things and I was like I is the fuck is that shit like I don't know what that is I don't fucking want to try whatever that is well they're like here have it fuck it anyway for potentially your butt and it doesn't say anything it says fast absorbing body cream tightens and smooths like no other but why would I need to tighten and well like like squats tighten my butt but why would I need to smooth it like there's not really a lot of people down there besides myself and my significant other so I mean, I mean, maybe for that, if you want to smooth your butt for your significant other, or unless, if, I don't know, you're showing your butt a lot, I just, just don't know, guys. I don't, I don't, I don't fucking know. I just don't understand. Anyway, so that, so that happened. <laughs> uh, maybe I'll remember to research it, but probably not, because I got to render this and get it out before I go to work. Anyway, you guys have a happy rest of your Monday mornings. I'm going to render this, and then I'm going to chill and go to work. Oh, 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 another thing. Oh, hold on. I nearly forgot about this. I'm going to San Diego Comic Con, guys. Like, that's like the mother of cons in Friday. <laughs> in Friday, I was going to try and count the days, but it's still morning, and I don't know how to function at this point. Um, well, I guess I would be five days. <laughs> if we count today. Anyway, yeah, San Diego Comic Con is coming up and it is the mother of cons and my awesome friend John who lives in California, which is in that direction to me. And he was like, hey brah, here's a pass. And I'm just like, oh my God, well now I have to go. So I'm going to San Diego Comic Con. So I'm so excited because I hear that's like the mother of cons and I've never been to Cali thus so far. So that shall be interesting though. It's going to be a long drive because I'm going to literally leave work Thursday night and then drive there and then be tired, really tired, because it's going to be about a five-hour drive, but that will be super exciting. I'll try and take lots of pictures and such, maybe videos, I don't fucking know, and show you guys. Uh, okay, that's all now. I'm, I'm done rambling. Okay, you guys have a happy rest of the Mondays. Bye! See my power!